Hello everyone, and welcome to this video about GPT for All, the new open source AI chatbot tool that will change the way you interact with technology. This video is the first of a series of videos where we'll be showing you how to install GPT for All, how to update it, how to download and use different models, how to customize the personality of the chatbot, how to control the chatbot settings, how to use the chatbot from an external PC or phone, how to export discussion database and share it, and finally, we'll discuss future developments and how you can participate in the GPT for All community. Let's start by installing GPT for All. First, go to the GPT for All GitHub repository and download the latest version of the tool. If you have Git installed on your PC, it is advised to clone the repository, and if not, you can just download the zip file and extract it. Once downloaded and extracted or cloned, go to the folder and run the install script. For Windows users, use install.bat, and for Linux or Mac OS users run install.sh. It is advised to have Git, Python, pip, and virtual env installed on your PC, if not the installer will ask for your permission to install these tools. The tool will install all you need to run the user interface. At the end it will prompt you if you want to download the base model to your models folder. In our case, we'll do it manually afterwards. To download the models, go back to the project git repository and scroll down to supported models section. You can test any of these models. The base one is on my hugging face space. To download it, just press GPT for all 7B to start the download. Make sure you put the file in the model subfolder of the project. You can also visit my hugging face model space dedicated to this model. The model is released by Nomic AI with GPL 3.0 license. In the next video, I will show you how to use the web interface to get the most of your chatbot. Make sure you like and subscribe so that you don't miss them. See ya!